Hey guys, Everything for Tech here. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be trying to help you guys to solve a problem that uh, occurs when trying to SSH into your iDevice um, while using CyberDuck on a Mac. Uh, now, this is probably the error you get. It says IO error, uh, connection failed. Um, so, there is a way to fix this. As you can see, if I hit try again, it'll just keep doing that. And my iPhone is uh, all properly set up, so it's not the iPhone. Uh, so, I'm going to just show you how to how to get this, this fixed. Now in your on your iDevice you have to go to Cydia um, let's see a load okay now in Cydia you have to go to uh, you have to search for iFile you download a program called iFile um, there's different sources you can get this under I have it under the XLI source, as you can see here. Um, so just download whichever one, they're all the same. Um, now once you get iFile, you must go into it. <laughs> okay, so when you're in iFile, um, iFile, it, it looks like this. It's kind of like SSHing into your phone, just not through a computer. You can look at all your the codes and all the files inside your phone. Uh, but be very careful because, first of all, I am not responsible for anything you do to potentially break your phone. Uh, if you delete a file by accident, uh, I'm sorry, it's your fault. Um, I guess you're going to have to restore. Uh, okay, so first, you want to go, uh, you're going to hit back until you're at this little slash there. You see the slash on the side. There should be a back button here. Um, you'll see all these files. You want to go to System, Library obviously uh, you go down and you go to launch uh, demons and then you have to scroll down and find find com dot i key dot bot it should be at the bottom I have all this stuff in the in the link in the description if you didn't understand me or you didn't catch on quickly enough so right here is the file you want to delete that make sure it is the right one just double checking. Yep, it's right. Delete. So you delete that file. Uh, then you go back to the slash again. You go under bin. And you delete the file called. It's just over here. Uh, POC uh, B, B bot. So delete that. Close that. Go into Cydia. You have to go back into Cydia. And you want to reinstall OpenSSH. Don't remove it. Just reinstall it. SSH. Now this is OpenSSH, not automatic SSH. So you want to go for OpenSSH, modify, reinstall, confirm, let it do its thing. Okay, return to Cydia. Now, you just want to close out of Cydia and restart your phone. I'm going to use uh, SP settings to restart it. You can just turn it off and turn it back on. Boot. Let that do its thing. I'll probably just come back to the video when it's done. Okay, uh, now that we are back, wow, fail, and we are all powered back on. Uh, just make sure you are connected to Wi-Fi and you go into toggle SSH and you hit enable and it should work. I'm going to do a little test here uh, to hopefully prove myself right and not waste this whole video. Uh, Alpine as the password. Oh, and there we go. Allow. And we have SSH'd into my iPhone. And it most likely worked for you. Uh, this error will probably occur uh, after a certain amount of time. I actually got the, I had to restore my phone recently. Um, and I just got it as soon as I got it back. 
I had to, like, I, as soon as I got SSH, SSH into it once, and then it just stopped working. So, uh, here's your solution. If you don't know how to SSH into your iPhone, um, there will probably be a video, an annotation, probably right around here, um, on how to do that. And, uh, yeah, that's it. That's pretty much it. So, hope this helped. Uh, this is everything for tech. Wow, everything for tech. And, as always, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.